Hey everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Stellaris. So, since we're probably about to get attacked by space mushrooms of doom in predictable future, I have a plan. I'm pretty sure I can't avoid this war. I did move an embassy here, but we're at minus 205. I'm pretty sure they are about to attack us. And there's no way we can beat them. It's not going to happen. Even with an alliance, they are just way too strong. And most other AIs are weaker than me. Or significantly weaker than me. So my plan is to throw either everything we have at them, or almost everything, and hopefully we'll destroy at least one ship, so that it will leave some debris behind. And we'll analyze that debris to get some of their technologies. That's basically our plan. We will obviously have to accept their demands. There's just no way around that. But hopefully we'll get some of their technology out of this. Only one way to find out, but that's the plan in a nutshell. And our science ships need something to do. Let's take a look. There's still one system to survey over here. This one. And we got that special project. Let's take care of that. Alright, and we can check our planets real quick. We're actually about to unlock power plant 3. We'd want to upgrade every single power plant everywhere. Plus 6 food, that's good enough for now. I might move one guy to get more energy. Well, only plus 2, probably not worth it. Alright, carry on then. We can clear some of the blockers. And we can check our other planets. Might as well upgrade the farms. Especially since this planet is still growing. Might as well give it all the extra food we can. Just upgrade the farms. And this one, yep. What about the spaceports? Let's take a look. I think we should get some corvette assembly yards. Because we're about to need a lot of corvettes. I'm just saying. Yeah, let's get some corvette assembly yards. I'll need to rebuild my fleet very quickly. We can always replace Corvette assembly yards later with something else. It's only plus or it's only minus 100 minerals to build them. Not a big deal. And they only cost one energy maintenance. They are pretty cheap. And I will be spamming a lot of Corvettes. I hope we have enough. Because there's no guarantee they will leave debris behind. We'll have to destroy at least one ship in order to make it happen. It's not a guarantee, that's for sure. But hopefully the plan will work. I need to get something useful out of this war. And there's the power plant, nice. What can we get next? The next laser. Shield capacitor. That's extra shield regeneration. I think I'll go for the laser. Yep, let's go for the laser. We're a little bit behind in laser research. So, it would be nice to catch up, merge all of these guys into one fleet. There we go, that's basically our entire fleet right now. Ships upgraded. Construction that wasn't much of an upgrade. Alright, and now we wait for the inevitable, because I'm pretty sure it's going to happen. There's no way I can avoid it when I piss them off. Construction Minus 198. I did send a diplomat here, or established an embassy. 150 engineering research gained. Alright, thanks. That's not a whole lot, but every little bit helps. Anyway, let's upgrade all these power plants. It will cost us a bit, but we got 15,000 minerals. Not a big deal. And we should just start building all these corvettes, you know, without waiting for the war. The war might not actually happen, but I'm pretty sure it will. I don't think we can avoid it. But I did send the diplomat just in case we can actually avoid it. I'm not really getting my hopes up, but... Who knows, maybe it will work. Power plant... Power plant... Still, I have a plan, if they declare war. 
get some of their attacks. Upgrade. Upgrade. Alright, we can finish the rest later. Let's check the food. I don't think any planet is starving. One food, three food, zero food on Earth. Alright. Well, that's still fine. It's not starving. Which is perfectly okay. Oh yeah, and this planet as well. Upgrade to planetary administration. Construction complete. Alright, how's our research going? Four months to finish plus 10% naval capacity. Yep, they declared war. I knew it. What do they want? Artificial intelligence ban, humiliate, and abandon the planet. We can just recolonize the planet, right? I don't see why not. Let's get the colony ship right away. So hopefully we have enough. We will get wrecked. That's kind of unavoidable. System survey complete. But I need to get some of their techs. What's this supposed to be? Oh, these are transports, right. Okay, we'll take care of the transports. Hey, come back here. Are they withdrawing? No, I don't think they are. That would be a little bit surprising. System surveyed, back to the fight. Yep, they are already coming. That's a pretty damn big fleet. That's what, 36,000? That's a little bit much. We got some debris. Do we really have to attack them both at the same time? Because I have a feeling we'll get wrecked. Escort. Okay, let's try to attack the escorts. There's no way we can take down the battleship, probably. So attack the escort. I hope it's going to work. I will lose this entire fleet. There's no real way around it. There's a research. Plus 10% border range. We need that badly. There are a few systems we might grab as a result of this. So please leave some debris behind. Don't disappoint me. We are attacking the proper one, right? Yes, we are. Okay, we just need to destroy one. Come on. I'm not sure if we'll do it. I don't think we'll do it, actually. Okay, they did leave some debris behind. That's good. We lost our entire fleet as a result. I hope it was worth it. Only one way to find out. But they did leave some debris behind. We got time. There's no need to rush it. And I suppose we can just surrender. Because it's not like we're going to win. We might as well accept their demands. Yeah, we have to accept everything, right? Yeah, there's no way around that. Okay. Fine. So we did lose the colony. Oh, we also lost the king. Actually, that's not necessarily a bad thing, because now we'll be able to build the garden again. Because I can only build the garden once per ruler. So this isn't necessarily a bad thing. Okay. Now, let's analyze that debris and find out whether it was worth it or not. Why are we still controlling this? Probably because I didn't unpause. That's most likely it. Where's the closest science ship? This one. Alright, let's go then. Research, research. I hope this was worth it. Implants not removed, what? Okay. Incoming transmission. Incoming transmission. I'm not really interested in an alliance. Also, we need to start rebuilding our fleet because, you know, we don't have a fleet currently. <laughs> well, technically, we got one cruiser. Go you. Alright, let's spam some cruisers. I don't have access to battleships yet. So, we can't build those. This is my best design currently, so we'll just spam some cruisers. And destroyers. Actually, I think we need to design a destroyer manually. Because I'm pretty sure that auto design is terrible. Alright. Let's have a look. Plus 20% fire rate. Plus 20% weapons damage. Plus 15% chance to evade. 
yeah, we should go for that one. And let's check the sections. Oh, we can get one large weapon on a destroyer. Though we want to. Can we get something special in that slot? Not really. I don't think that's worth it then. One medium and two small. And one medium here. Let's start from the reactors. Because we'll obviously need those. And some shields. Okay. Weapons. Which weapons do we want here? I'm working on a better laser. The Stormfire autocannon isn't bad. Oh, this is exactly zero. I think we'll go for that then. Not very creative. <laughs> Sorry. Save. And that's going to be our destroyer. At least one of them. I might design more than one. Alright. So let's build some destroyers in spaceports that cannot build cruisers at the moment. Good enough. And cruisers. Yep, this one. And that's all we can afford at the moment. Right, I just spent pretty much all of my minerals. Hey, it was worth saving up 15,000 minerals. I just hope this was worth it. We'll find out. This is the pile their escort ships left behind. So we should get credit for some really good techs. Let's check our new ruler. Fortifier, space miner. Not super useful, but now we can actually build the garden again. Let's see, which planet do we want to build that on? One of the big ones. What about this one? Yeah, I think we should build it on this one. Happiness is a little bit low here. Yep, let's build it here. Yep, done. Unfortunately, we'll get some penalties for 20 years. But that's just unavoidable. Cumulated. Minus 33%. On the bright side, I was only getting plus one. So this won't really affect us. Because we are spending free influence per month for the subject integration. And the integration is nowhere close to done. Okay, that's a lot of text. I think it was worth it already. These are all quite valuable text. Let's actually check them all out. So, yeah, we can cancel this for a moment. Tachyon lances. Right here. Okay. Face disruptors, right here. Predictive algorithms. I don't think that's... Yep, that's right here. That's point defense. Neutronium materials. I don't think that's going to be in this category. Zero point power down here. Okay. So there's just one missing. And hyper shields right here. Neutronium materials is in engineering. So we can check engineering. Do we want to continue our previous research? I think so. That was the laser. Might as well finish it. And... No, I didn't want to cancel that. That was the debris. Yep, carry on. We'll finish that first. Neutronium materials is just better armor, I think. Much better armor. Alright, uh, can we survey anything? Yes, we can. Off you go then. So, colony ship. Let's just recolonize that planet. It is a pretty good planet. I don't think that will piss them off. I don't see why not. I'm not 100% sure. Well, I'm not giving up that planet. So let's just recolonize it. It will be slightly annoying recolonizing it from zero, but all the buildings are still there. Can we just pop it down here? Apparently so. Okay. Useful. 
Come on, give me something useful out of this. That was the transport fleet. Over here. Debris what did we get? Zero point power. Nothing new then. Okay, that's fine. I think it was worth it. We lost a lot of ships, but we got credit for some really good techs. So, anything else we can survey in this area? Yes, there's one more system we can survey. Alright then, carry on. And let's recolonize that planet ASAP. The colony ship is on the way. And we can check our production queues. There. Already colonizing it. Wait, are we? System survey Isn't that the wrong planet? System survey complete. No, that is the correct planet. Construction complete. It got renamed. Wait. Hold on. I don't care about that war. Did it get renamed or am I going crazy? Complete. I'm not going crazy, am I? That was a little bit strange. Well, doesn't matter, I suppose. Carry on. I just hope we won't piss off the space mushrooms of doom. All the buildings are still there, so it got renamed. Plus 5% habitability, plus 5% happiness. Did this planet get rerolled? Because this was not here before, was it? I'm slightly confused what actually happened there. But hey, I'm not complaining. <laughs> anyway, back to work. We still got quite a few systems to survey. In this area, there might be some aliens in there, but I guess we'll just kill them then. Merge all of that crap. We need to start rebuilding our fleet. Would be nice to unlock battleships sometime soon. Well, hopefully we will. Cruisers will have to do, for now. Wait, one of the planets is starving. Earth is starving, really? Minus two. Well, I guess we have to replace one of the power plants. Or the mining network. We're getting plus 225 minerals. I think we'll just replace the mining network with a farm. Yep. Alright, that's fine. We have enough minerals. Carry on. Oh, and we still got some buildings to upgrade. And aliens. How's our research? We could use some more physics. Is this set to evasive stance? Yes, it is. Keep merging. It will take a while to rebuild the entire fleet, but oh well. I think it was worth it for all the techs that we got credit for. Anything else we can survey? Yep. Well, no, that's slightly out of range. We need a new wormhole station. We should colonize that crappy Gaia planet. Was this planet any good? Yeah, it was actually pretty decent. Size 22. We should colonize that one. But sectors. I have to think about which planets to add to sectors. Because I can't sit at 9 out of 7. Anyway, that's an ocean planet, which means... We'll need ocean... Preference. Yeah, we need that planet that was part of the sector. It was this one exactly. That one has ocean pops. Yep, this one. These guys. Individualist. I might actually grab these guys. No, these don't have ocean preference. Alright. Done. 
We'll colonize that planet. It's a pretty good one. I'll figure out what to do with sectors once it's colonized. There, done. So now we're sitting at 8 out of 7 again, which is okay. Build space pod right away. So we don't have to rebuild all these buildings, which is nice, I suppose? I thought I'll have to rebuild them. But alright. It won't be so bad after all, then. And we need to bring constructors. We got one here already. Get to work, then. Mining stations. And then mining stations here. Off you go. Construction complete. Construction complete. Construction complete. Losing some energy, but that's because we're sitting at 8 out of 7. We'll just have to deal with it for a bit. I need to take a closer look at all these planets. Where's this planet exactly? Let's pause for a second. Right here. Oh yeah, that's the system with the observation outpost. I think I'll just have to give up that observation outpost. Because really, this is the crappiest planet that I'm directly controlling right now. Well, this one also isn't amazing. Oh yeah, this one is all the way here. I'd rather... Well, we could start a sector here, I suppose. That's not a terrible idea. Might be a decent enough plan. It will be a one-planet sector for now. If I'm going to colonize more in this area, I suppose that makes sense. Yeah, this planet certainly isn't amazing. Alright, fine, this is going to be the sector. A new one. Empire planets. We are at 3 out of 6. Alright, create a new sector. That was the one, right? I don't want to mess this up. Yeah, that was the one. Okay, just one, since I can't connect it with the others. It might just end up being one planet sector, just its own one, which isn't really a problem. What preference are we going to set there? I don't think they need a governor all that much, especially when our influence isn't exactly good. Was this guy? Oh yeah, research, right. So, 25% and set it to research focus. We can give them some stuff. That planet is pretty much fully developed, so it's not really necessary. Anyway, done. It's probably going to end up being one planet sector. Which, again, isn't really a problem. Diplomatic insult. I don't care about what you have to say. How do they compare to us now, when we have a crappy fleet? They are still pathetic, yeah, we don't care about them at all. In fact, I could just vassalize them if I want to. Maybe we should do that? I think we should actually do that. I see no reason not to. And keep them as a vassal. Let's finish that colony. I think the colony ship is done already. Yep, it's done. Right here. So you will go all the way over here. Colonize. And this seems like a good enough location. Alright, off you go. That's a pretty good planet. I still want that crappy Gaia planet. But we'll see about that one. What's going on? Investigate aliens. I don't think we'll be doing that. Hi. Ruthless capitalists. Okay then. Where exactly are they? 
somewhere close to the mushrooms? No, I don't think so. I can't quite see them. We'll find them later, doesn't really matter all that much. And we need to queue up some more cruisers. What again? Oh, okay, hold on, ethic changes. This might be interesting. Which planet is that exactly? Is this the planet name? Or well, system name, whatever. Oh, that's the primitives. I don't think I care about that then. Yeah, we don't really care about that. Alright. Anyway, I'm going to make a cut here and continue in the next episode. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.